Good morning, you lovely lot. Let me turn this around so you can actually see me. We're in a winter wonderland. The inside of Spog looks like a winter wonderland. Look at those, it looks like trees. Christmas trees. Is that frozen on the inside? No. Oh, good. Kenzie, why am I not working? Oh, he doesn't feel very well, which means we've got to go for a COVID test. And he's only just out of his 90 days. That is a bit frozen on the inside, you know. A definite change to my planned day, for sure. But you know, these things happen. He's all snuffly, had a temperature, feeling rubbish. Good job it wasn't yesterday, hey, when you had your exam. Mm. Mm. I didn't feel well yesterday, but... Oh, you didn't? I had to go. You didn't tell me you didn't feel well. Told you, after school. you did, yes. In fairness. That's for uh, tropical with all the, you know, do yep. Thank you. Eleven o'clock, and I'm finally having some breakfast. Mm -hmm. Leah's home because he has a course to do. Um, obviously I can't work because I've had to take Kenzie for a test so until he comes back negative, which I'm sure he will, but we have to follow the procedures, so we are. Um, so yeah, I've got a course that I have got waiting to complete, a safeguarding course which my qualification runs out in February. So I should probably <clears throat> sit and do that today. And I might do a live stream in a minute when I've finished eating. Hmm. It is a day of things happening. I've now got to run across the road and meet a neighbor who's on the parish council, who's going to bring out some paperwork for me to sign because the forest school lease is up and I need to sign the renewed contract. So um, he said, can I come to you? I was like, well, you can't really because Kenzie's self-isolating, but um, I can come to you. And he said, oh, let's meet on the doorstep. So I'm going to go meet him at his wall where we've got like a table, a wall table to use to sign things on. And uh, thankfully he's not far away, so we can go in the slippers. Kenzie's feeling all weak. Weak and feeble. Mm. Have to go and take the temperature. And I'll keep mixing for With you. The broken <laughs> Well, it only gave a, a fever thingy on you, even if it was intermittent. It Easy didn't do it for the rest of us. How much mixing does that require? Has it got to be I smooth? Know. I think so. This is quite lumpy. <laughs> Have you got enough liquid in it? Yeah. Because you used gluten free flour, didn't you? Uh huh. Which. The tends... gluten smooths it. Um, it absorbs more water, you usually need more liquid. Okay. Did it, was it this sticky when you did it last time? I didn't do that recipe last time. But was the, was the mixture sticky? No. Then it probably needs a bit more water. Go take your temperature, see how you're yeah. feeling. Yeah, gluten free tends to absorb more water. Boom. 
he looks weary. I have completed my business transaction down the road. Thankfully, he only lives across the road, so <laughs> made life easy. See, that's gone very gloopy again, very quickly. It smells a bit samalinery. Mm. It is very lumpy, but hopefully it'll be fine. I'll put it in there like a waffle maker, maybe. I think it just it glides across it. It does say pour, and I there's no way we can pour this mixture, is there? No. But I think it's because the... But then it's, you wouldn't pour it anyway, would you? It's the consistency of the guy that was making it on the video you sent me. Oh, okay. Well, I was going to say it wouldn't pour anyway, would it? Because otherwise you'd put it into the fat thing. If you were doing them in the traditional way, mm. then it would end up going everywhere, wouldn't it? It would just be a big... I think it's, a bit, uh, it's going very wrong. <laughs> It's fine. It's, already it's like a beast. Still coming out this side. It's coming out this side. It's, it's, coming out this side. Look. <laughs> it's expanding. This recipe was not. Still not impressed with this recipe. Maybe we just put too much in. Mm. It's making noises. <laughs> <laughs> it's trying to break free. I think maybe we put too much in. I put too much in. <laughs> well, it's about lunchtime. Kenzie has made me some very lovely churros. Got a cup of tea. And I need to log into my safeguarding website that I use for the local area, uh, the county one, and do my safeguarding training. I've got two courses I need to do, but I have to do this one first and then so you have your designated lead and your generalist safeguarding, but I have to do both because I am my own boss. Uh, why, why is it telling me my login has expired? I think you'll find it. Let's reset my password. <laughs> Frustratingly, I can't get onto the course because my login's not working and I've emailed them and I'm waiting on them to come back to me. Uh, I have received a lovely package from the lovely Donny at uh, Donny's World of Adventure, Donny's uh, Van Life Adventure, uh, sorry Donny, can't remember exact. I'll put your channel anyway in the um, description box in case anyone wants to go check you out. Um, he saw me trying to fix the diesel heater, saw that I was having troubles, and he sent me some of these self-drilling screws and self-drilling bolts and various sizes. And I think he said in here is a drill bit for metal. There we go, a metal drill bit as well. So if I get stuck um with the self-drilling doodars then i can drill oh excuse me so um very very grateful for those thank you donny that is i mean at the moment it's it's holding but i do need to do a proper fix on it uh in other news the postman arrived with kenzie's paperwork from the um, from the people at Swansea um, DVLA it doesn't contain his driving license 
for his provisional, but it also doesn't, or his bike license, it also doesn't provide, doesn't include a letter saying that he hasn't provided the right details. So I'm hoping if you watched the video back before Christmas where we sent all the stuff off, but we didn't have the exact stuff they needed for ID, um, I'm hoping that means that what we did send them was enough um, and that they're then going to send us the provisional, not, it acts as a provisional driving license once he turns 17, but up until that point it's um, a provisional for his, or he can, he can do a moped on it once he's passed that course, he can do the moped. Um, and obviously that's what he wants to do for his birthday he wants a moped and he wants to do the course and then be self-sufficient um so yeah that looks that's looking positive so far it's looking positive um i think i'm going to do a live stream since i can't do my training kenzie's lay in bed um and brendan uh, lee's doing his course and brendan's at work and as soon as brendan comes in from work he's getting dropped off by a work colleague um, he's going to come straight in, probably go to the loo, and then he's out for two hours doing his driving lesson. So I'm not going to see very much of him much before seven o'clock tonight. Um, but it does mean he'll be getting some dark driving experience, which he hasn't done yet. So that's another skill that he'll be practicing. Anyway, I'll stop waffling and I'm going to set up a live stream on my laptop because I've got my laptop down here. And I don't think the camera's as good, but we'll see how it goes. Uh, a surprise, midweek, midday, or middle of the day, well actually it's not, it's probably nearer half two now. Um, random live stream. If you're about, hopefully you'll have joined me. Hello. I've just done a nearly two hour live stream. Um, now I'm feeling hungry so I'm going to heat up some of the salmon rice that Kenzie made yesterday for his exam and see what else I fancy with it although that's probably more than enough I shall heat it up is there a man lurking no idea come hither come on there's someone lurking <laughs> this should be our thumbnail let's let's <laughs> there you go. That was thumbnail in action. Bye. Oh. That's Kenzie's lovely meal he's made for me, and I've added some uh, chopped up raw pepper and some chopped up raw spring onion, just to add a little bit of extra to it. It's about half past five, and I'm going to end the vlog here. Um, it's as you can see, it's been a bit of a weird day. Things have not gone quite to plan, and. It's been very bitty, bobby type day. Um, didn't get to do my course, but I might be able to log into that tomorrow. I have now had an email back from them. So fingers crossed I can get in and, and do that course um, over the weekend. I've got some other things I'd like to get done over the weekend, like cleaning out the fish tank, which I didn't do because it ended up doing what ended up being a two hour live stream. Um, but it was really interesting. We had some interesting conversation and debate and loved it really nice sometimes to have a good chat with your viewers so lee's just sorting out his dinner kenzie doesn't feel like eat, eating anything brendan's off on his driving lesson so i'm going to make the most of some peace and quiet and go and have a nice bubbly bath and maybe even read my book thank you very much for watching i'll see you tomorrow